Now, the main purpose of the advanced USB doctor is to restore all your files that has been corrupted by viruses, trojans, and other stuff. Now, let's look at what these viruses and trojans can do. Now, if you take a good look at my document, you can see all of them are shortcuts now. So, what we are going to do now is install the advanced USB doctor. So let's get the advanced USB doctor. Now, to download this software, you have to open your browser and in the address bar, you type in D, the area with the D, D where, but, sorry, D, D where, dot TK. Then you hit on enter. It will bring you to the home page. Then you click on download. It will take you to the download page. Now, now when the download page opens, scroll down, you see the advanced USB doctor here. You click on download this download symbol click on the download and it will start downloading in a few seconds so here we are we have the download so you click on start download then to start downloading so let's wait for the download to complete then we'll do the installation Now here we are with the advanced USB doctor version 3.2. Now we are going to go through the installation process. First, double click to start the installation, but first we'll check for a new version, whether a new version is available and it will inform you. Now, the next process as usual you just click next or install and the process will begin on its own now let's wait for the installation to complete now as you can see we have the installation process completed so you can choose to run the, pro the program or you can click finish to put off this window now let's run the program so I click on run and the software will launch. So let's wait for the software. Now we have this wonderful and simple interface delivered to us and it's fixed for itself. This side is for the pen drives and on the left hand side is for the fixed drive. That's the CD-ROM, the hard drives and removable, let's say external hard drives. Okay, now let's take a quick look on how to clean a pen drive in just a few seconds. Now, what is going to happen now is I'm going to insert my pen drive into the system. And let's look at what happens when I insert it. Okay, I've inserted a pen drive and Let's look at what happens. This is the auto run or auto play as usual. And the pen drive has been registered here. So, what happens is let's scan and see what happens. I click on scan and voila! <coughs> A whole lot of all the shortcuts and other stuff are listed here. So you can click on scan and repair. That will do it very quickly or you can click on repair and delete. That will bring back all your files and delete all the shortcuts or the files that are not needed on the pen drive. So let me click on repair and delete. So it's going through a process of removing and deleting other stuff. Now it says here the process has been completed. 
so as it has been completed let's look at what happens to the drive so i'm going to open the drive and we'll now this is the end result of my drive as you can see all the files has been restored and we don't have the shortcut symbol attached to it anymore so this software is very important and it's very good it's also good for auto run it can delete auto runs so that it won't infect your system now how to scan the fixed drives they have their scan button down here so you just click on the drive click on scan and you can see an auto run has been found on this particular drive so you just have to click on repair and delete and it automatically take care of that now when a pen drive is inserted and, a, and threads are found on the drive a message will be shown at the bottom here this is one for you to you can click on ignore or clean to take a quick action on what to do so this one helps a lot it alerts you when threads are found on your on your pen drive or your external drives or any other drive that you insert into the system let's take a quick look at the features of this software now we can see the activity page that includes the drives and this is the where the threads will be shown and this button is for repair and delete that is to repair your drive and delete them the same thing happens to that of the fixed drives and for a quick scan and repair when you insert your pen drive you can select if there are multiple pen drives they will be shown here you select them and click on either scan for you to see the viruses on them or you can click on scan and repair for a quick scan now let's go to the settings and with the settings uh, we have a few this one is to automatically delete threats when they are found so when you check this option the threats will be deleted immediately they are found and with this one it will start this application automatically when the system or your window starts now we have more languages added to the software so you can choose language that suits you so when for instance i choose english click on save the language changes from english to french the same thing happens when I reverse it and it has changed back to English that is good huh all right this update is for you to check whether there are new updates and it shows your software is up to date so that means there are no updates for this software all right in case this software helps you a lot then help those who help develop this program by donating you click on donate and you go to our donation page and you can donate any amount and we will appreciate that thank you very much